everybody. How y'all doing? Thank you for coming back as always. I appreciate it. I really hope you're having a wonderful day or night. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Deluxe. All right, go down there, hit them like, shares, prayers, and care bears. Go down there and sub for me. Uh, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and on my Facebook page. All in the description, easy peasy. All right, doing a what's new in Transformers. That's where I took a look at something that's new, uh, that we've seen new pictures or something on TFW, Facebook, whatever, and all that good stuff and everything. So it uh, looks like we got some new TF Element and uh, Beast Wars, and we got some new Toy World. Oh, let's take a look. All right, up first we have Transformers Element. This is the uh, Legend Scale Black Arachnia from Beast Wars. So yeah, it looks like she's uh, doing some stretching or just uh, posing for the camera. I don't know what she's doing, but you know, looks pretty good. All right, there she is, just standing there, all historic, you know, heroic and everything. I say historic, <laughs> but anyways, yeah, she's a. Uh, I like it. I think it looks really good, you know, especially for legend scale. I'm really excited for this. And there is she doing some, you know, aerobics or something. I don't know if she's doing some posability and all that good stuff. So looks like she's going to be flexible. So that's really good. I like that purple in the background too, that's very nice. And another one where she's flying through the air or something like that, so looks really good. Nice. Like I said, I love that purple background. I love the dio for they used for her, it's really good. And there's an up close picture of her, and that's really good. Face cup looks really good. So yep. Yeah. And there she is in alt mode. Nice. I like that. I like the sand also, that's pretty cool. Alright, there's a close up pic of the alt mode. So not bad looking. Yep, another pick uh, from a side view, so it looks nice. So yeah, I'm really excited for Black Arachnia for Legend Scale. I think they're, you know, doing something good. They got a rat trap coming too, so very nice. Up next, we got some full images of Toy World's Optimus Prime from the Bumblebee movie. And this thing looks beautiful. Uh, it looks really nice, really detailed. Oh man, this is going to be a good one, I think. And there he is from the back. Looks really nice. He's got a robot on his back. It looks like, you know, Johnny number five, but man, so good. Looks really clean. I mean, I mean, this thing transforms too. Jeebus. And there's a side view of it. And then you got, uh, we'll talk about Ravage in the background, but he's coming up. But yeah, looks really good. There he is with his arm on Bumblebee. Man, perfect scale, I think. Looks really good. And there he is next to the Studio Series one. And man, he's so, he's pretty big. It's going to be a big fella right there. And one more next to uh, Bumblebee. Nice. Very nice. And there he is next to a picture of uh, what Prime looked like in the movie. So, yep. And here's a side view uh, from it. Looks nice. I like that. I like that his gun and everything. I wonder if he's going to get the same gun too. And here he is next to the 3A Model 1. And the 3A one doesn't transform. So this one's going to transform and it looks really nice. Jeebus. And here's the back view. Mm-hmm. Very nice. And there's next to the Prime 1 Studio statue. So, uh, Toy World, man, come on now. Let's give it up for Toy World a little bit. They look really good. Uh, backside of the Prime 1 Studios also. So, yeah, this one I'm really excited for. The Toy World of Prime. Yeah, I'm definitely in on this one. Then we got new images of Ravage, which this came out of nowhere. Uh, yeah, it looks like somebody took a picture with a potato, but, you know, it's not clear pics. But, yeah, there's Ravage. I'm hoping we get a sound wave. And there he is compared to the, you know, the screen uh, adaption or whatever, the movie. So, I don't know. Uh, Ravage looks pretty cool. I wonder if he's going to transform into a, what he's going to transform into, a tape or something? Or, I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, there's uh, the three new uh, Transformers we're getting. All right. Well, I hope you liked this little slideshow. There's a lot of pictures to be shown. But, hey, we got some new stuff. Yay. So, Transformers Element first. Uh, they are, you know, we got news of the Black Arachnia for the MP version. So, why not do us, you know, a Legend Scale? And they said, here, here you go. We got you covered. So, yeah, they're doing her and they're doing a Rat Trap. Uh, but they show some better pics of this one, you know, better prototypes of it. It looks really good. I'm not going to lie. You know, I'm really, you know, I'm into the Legends game. You know, and Beast Wars, I'm, I'm definitely going down. I'm, I'm probably going to get their Megatron. It looks pretty good. And this does not look that bad at all, you know, in both alt mode and in robot mode. Because, you know, got some good articulation. Uh, I can't, I'm ready to see some uh, color pics and everything. That would be pretty cool. So, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm really interested in this. They don't have a price on it yet but uh there's pre-orders up for it and you know go out there and you know support beast wars yay and we got picks some more picks of the transform uh, toy world uh, Bumble uh bumblebee movie uh prime Golly, I can't think of uh. So yeah, we got some new pics of the Prime. We, it's a full body now. We had, I showed earlier, we got some, uh, you know, the alt mode, and then we got some of the legs and stuff and everything. But now we got a full picture of him, and he looks 
beautiful. I'm not gonna lie, a lot of nice details. They showed it. I showed you some pictures against the 3A and stuff and everything. And it looks really good. I can't wait to see some color pics of this guy because it's very nice. I think this is what Toy World is gonna bring Toy World back into the game because we got a new uh, Ravage from the movie also. So you know, it looks pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. I, I think it looks decent. You know, I'm not really you know high on hopes on getting a Ravage, but I don't know. They may get them. And you know what? If they start doing Soundwave, if they do the Tetra Jets, they do RC, Ironhide, you know, all those cliff jumpers. If they do this movie, and like I said before, this might could bring Toy World back into the limelight. I'm not gonna lie. This this could turn some heads and get people interested because you know the the B movie, the first 10 minutes, a lot of people loved it and they would love to have some characters from that. So I think this is gonna help Toy World. I really do. So if we see a sound wave or some Tetra Jets. Come on now, Shockwave, they bring Shockwave in, like, oh my goodness, this is going to be fun. I really think it's going to help Toy World and help the, you know, help them, you know, come back into the limelight. So yeah, let me hear from you. Let me see, are you interested in this? Are you excited, you know, for the movie stuff and for the, you know, Transformer Element, the Beast Wars and all that good stuff? And hit me up with some likes, shares, prayers, and care bears. Go down there and sub for me and all that good stuff. And I guess I'll see you on the next What's New in Transformers. And as always, hell Hasbro and good night, folks.